So what's better, YouTube TV or Hulu TV? A few months ago, we got rid of cable. We were paying too much for it. It wasn't worth the money anymore. And I switched over to YouTube TV. They had a seven day trial. Tried it out for a few days. Problem was, there wasn't an app you could download to Apple TV. Then I found out about Hulu TV. Tried out their seven day free trial. Loved it, worked great. Got live TV, got just about every station that we wanted. One of the problems with uh, Hulu TV is the menu is just out of control. There's too many options, there's too many ways to get everywhere. It took me forever to figure out how to get to live TV because there's not an actual live TV tab or button anywhere on the app. But other than that, it worked pretty well. Found out the next day after I got Hulu TV that YouTube TV had an app for Apple TV. And I was like, oh well, that, that could be an option for later on. And it was, because we found out that Hulu TV does not have AMC. Oh no, no. <laughs> and The Walking Dead was about to start. So, got rid of Hulu TV, signed up for YouTube TV. <laughs> the app that you download to uh, Apple TV is much easier to understand. There's basically three tabs. There's the live tab. There's the home tab and there's the recordings tab. Easier to understand, easy to navigate. Hulu TV will only let you watch two streams at one time. So if you have three people in your house wanting to watch Hulu TV, you can't do it. Somebody's got to log off for the other person to log on. YouTube TV will let you stream up to three at one time. It actually says you can have six profiles for one account. I'm not sure if that means you can have six profiles and each one can watch three streams or six profiles, but you can only watch three streams. So only three profiles can... So only, three pro, pro, so only three profiles can watch a stream. That I'm confused. Another thing about Hulu TV is that it only gives you 50 hours of record time. YouTube TV, unlimited. What? You can record forever. One thing I discovered on both Hulu TV and YouTube TV, if you're recording a show that is playing at the time you're recording it, you can't just go to your recordings tab and find the show. You actually have to go to live TV and then click on the show that's running and then rewind it. So it's not that big a deal, but something you might need to know for Hulu TV or YouTube TV. Let me show you a little bit of how uh, YouTube TV works. So when you first log in, it looks like this. You can see some of the top picks for you up here at the top. You, there's some resume watching here. Let's say you're watching something that was recorded. You can keep watching it here. Uh, these are just some, some different shows that are live right now and shows that uh, I guess are coming up to be, to be recorded, some sports stuff. But if you click over to live TV, here's a list of everything that is on TV right now that's live. So let's click on something and there's live TV. If you want to record these episodes, then you click on, there's a plus right here, plus. Show added to your library will record upcoming episodes as they become available. It doesn't really give you an option to record new stuff. I think it just records every episode of whatever it is. So if, if there's, there's a show that plays 50 times a day, I guess it records every episode. I don't think it repeats. It's not going to record the same episode over and over, but it will record every episode that's upcoming of whatever show you want to record. If you go to library, that is where all of the, that's basically your recorded section. Everything that you've recorded uh, is listed here. Recently recorded, scheduled recordings coming up, see upcoming, upcoming, got Jimmy Kimmel, Late Show, Kardashians, blah, 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 Talking Dead. These are recordings that we've, I think we've already watched down here. It's pretty easy to navigate, much easier than Hulu TV. I think the only problem with using Hulu TV or YouTube TV on the Apple TV app is the remote. As most people know, if you have Apple TV, the remote is horrible. So other than that, you know, the price is right for both of them. They're both about 35, 40 bucks. They give you a seven day free trial. So uh, you should try it out. You should try YouTube. Go to YouTube TV or go to Hulu TV and see, look at the stations and see what fits your, your needs the best. But for the most part, they're pretty close to being the same. Our biggest issue is The Walking Dead is not on Hulu TV. It's on YouTube TV. So that's why we're sticking with YouTube TV for now. So hope this helps. Leave a comment below if you have any questions. Uh, 
make sure to subscribe and also when you do subscribe hit the little bell by the subscribe button and uh, it'll give you notifications on when I upload new videos I got all kinds of new videos coming up hope this video helps and uh, we'll see you later